What it do, YouTube? It's your favorite coach, Coach Bird, back again with another one. So today, we're going to talk about this video that I saw the other day. Man, the sports truth. I think that's what it's called, sports truth. This guy right here, I subscribed about a week ago. And, um, you know, I'm trying to support the, you know, the, the young YouTubers, you know what I mean? Sports YouTubers up and coming, you know what I mean? So, so this guy posted a video about my favorite team, Florida State. Um, as you see, I got my hat on today, man. Uh, hurricanes in the background. So, he a hurricane fan, you know what I mean? I'm from, he ain't even from, number one, he ain't even from South Florida. <laughs> He had a video that he posted uh, his first time in Miami. But uh, I understand, man. Miami Hurricanes, they're a nation, man. They got fans everywhere, you know what I mean? So, But I'm actually from South Florida, and I don't like the Hurricanes. So. But, but I wanted to talk about his video, man. This guy said that he believes Florida State is imploding. He believes that Florida State next year will be between seven and five or five and seven for wins. I'm like, I'm watching that video. I'm like, what the heck? But I get it, man. I get it, man. You know, he on the other side, you know what I mean? So he watching. He watching us, you know what I mean? He watching the old Seminoles do their thing. And, you know, Deep down, he kind of upset. You know what I mean? He upset that, like, we had a 13-0 and season. Obviously, they didn't have it. They wish they did. But, look, same thing, man. If they had a 13-0 and season and their quarterback was hurt, they would have got left out too. <laughs> so, it, it just happened, man. It just is what it is. This the last year. Of the four team playoffs. Next year will be 12. So to be like talking trash about Florida State, 13 and 0, you know, they reached the pinnacle. Now they've been a drop. Man, that's a bunch of baloney, man. So he was talking about a couple of our players. He he said no nobody really on our team is nothing, you know, special except for two players. He was talking about Jared Verse. And um, Keon Coleman, but I'll say to him, look, if that's the case, man, look, because he was talking about our recruiting too, how, how we fell off at the end during recruiting. I, I'll say this: the reason why you guys did great in recruiting this year is because that's what Crystal Ball do, man. He's he's a master recruiter. That's what he does, but. At the same time, I believe Norvell, he's good at recruiting too. It's just not in the same vein as Crystal Ball, right? But he recruited Jared Verse and Keon Coleman. And you think, you thought highly of those two players. That's who Mike Norvell brought in. So don't, don't be too quick, man. Don't be too quick because nobody knew who Jared Verse was. They found him through video, man. So that means Mike Norvell, them good at eyeing players through the video, man. And finding players, diamonds in the rough, bro. So don't don't get it twisted, man. We, we still up. We still up. So that's why I just want to chime in on my man Sports Truth, man. Hey, I, I bless you, my brother. I, I love your channel, man. You're doing good. Keep it up. I see you have 500 something subscribers. I'm at three. I'm coming for you. Let's see. You you say you want to get that thousand. I want a thousand too. So I'm coming for you. We are gonna see who get there first. But um, yeah, bless you, man. Just just know that we coming for you. Don't worry about Florida State. We'll be all right. We'll be all right. And I believe we have more than seven wins next year. <laughs> we'll, we'll find a quarterback. We'll find a quarterback. Our receivers, we got great receivers like Hakeem Williams. We got, you won't even know about, 
coming up, man. We got DB class this year was outstanding. You know, we lost KJ, but it still worked out. And um, man, yeah, this this just, just a season. I just want to say one thing: if when we talk about um how you say oh everything look like it's breaking down right now as they go into this bowl game, dude. If you if your team went thirteen and zero, we talk about the Hurricanes. Your team went thirteen and zero, and they got left out of the playoff. And you have a few players eligible to go to the NFL draft. That that was their goal to win a national championship, and it was taken. Away. It was stripped away. And then now you're gonna tell them to go play in a bowl game. That that's not what their was goal was. Their goal wasn't just to play in the bowl game. Their goal was to play. For the NASA championship, which they put themselves in. And it was stripped away. So your players would have left too. So <laughs> so there's nothing imploding, bro. It's people just trying to make right right moves for themselves, man, at this point. Cause all is basically lost as the national championship is concerned. So but yeah, that's all I had to say, man. Bless you, brother. I love your channel. I, I ain't gonna stop subscribing. I'm still be a subscriber, and I'm still watching videos, man. But bless you. Hope you have a good one. Bless all my my subscribers, and and all you guys out there. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your favorite coach, Coach Bird channel. And uh, y'all have a good one. Go nose.